the button that Sasha gave me. It's a clue to the location of his secret lab. You know where this button is from, Coach? Hey! You stole a button from the geodesic psycho-isolation chamber! No, I didn't. I... Bobby Zilch gave it to me. Shoulda known. That kid spends more time in the cooler than in school. Reminds me of myself when I was his age. Well, go put it back! Yes, sir. Hey, Coach, where is the G? Don't you know how to use your map? Right, yes, sorry. Hey, if you have one of those buttons, too, we could play tiddlywinks. If I had one of those buttons, I could kill you with it in six seconds. Right, yes, sorry. Hey, did you hear that, Coach? I'm gonna get advanced training from Sasha Nine himself. Hey, hey, you stay away from that, Egghead. You hear me? Egghead? Permission to speak freely, sir. Denied! Listen, Private. Those scientific jokers, they don't know what it really means to be a psychonaut. It's about being in the field, not cooped up in some underground lab all day. It's underground? Aha! Uh -huh. Don't even think it! That brain tumbler contraption of his will turn your mind to mush! I need that brain! I mean, you need that brain! Now, dismiss, soldier! I've got some serious thinking to do. Lots of important planning. What kind of planning? Huh? What? What kind of planning are you doing there? In your sleep? Hey! Never assume a soldier is sleeping just because his eyes are closed. Trust me. That tip could save your life someday. But... Dismissed! Hey, Coach, will you teach me telekinesis? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, what rank do I have to earn before I learn clairvoyance? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, what's that radio do? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, how do I burn stuff? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, hypothetical question. Do you guys teach head explosion? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, what did you do before you were a head coach? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, what's Mia Vodello really like? I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Hey, Coach, in a life or death battle between Sasha Nine and a great white shark, where the shark could see the future, and Sasha was blindfolded, who do you think... I told you, Private. I've got a lot of scheming to do here. You're dismissed. Okay. I'm gonna close my eyes, right? And then I'm gonna start to count to a hundred, okay? And then you guys hide. Everybody got it? It's hide and seek, Vernon, not hide and calculus. We've all got it. I got it. You start counting, and then I go hide in that bush. Great. One. Milka, you're a genius. Come on, Duggan. Hold on. This reminds me of a story. It's about counting. Hello? Bad. you guys are good. Hey, Vernon, what's up? I'm hunting the most dangerous prey of all. Man. Any luck finding those guys, Vernon? Nope, not yet. This button look familiar to you? Oh, man. That's from the geodesic psycho-isolation chamber. That reminds me of this time I was stuck in there for three days straight. The first ten minutes weren't bad, but then the second five were pretty scary. I was delirious for the three after that, and then... Hey, I think I see Elko over there. Where? Oof. Raz, I'm sorry, but that's not how you play this game. You know, a nutcracker might be faster. 
tonight, when this baby is full of fine ladies, I'm going to see everything. How are you going to fill that nut with ladies? No, dude. The girl's cabin. I've got a man on the inside. I get it. You're using clairvoyance. You grabbed one of the squirrel's nuts, and now you're using clairvoyance on it to form a mental link and see what the squirrel sees. Um, could you say acorns instead of nuts if you repeat that to anybody else? Teach me how to do that. Hey, I paid a little bit of attention in class, but not that much. What you need is an expert in clairvoyance, where I am merely an expert in the ladies. Come on. Teach me clairvoyance. Go find an expert. I have no idea how I'm doing this. I think this button is a clue to the location of Sasha 9's secret lab. Really? Hang on. I'll use my power of clairvoyance on it to see if he's got any ladies in there. Nope. Just Maloof. And he's crying. I've heard that's what happens to kids who go for Sasha's advanced training too early. Now I'm never going to show you how to do this, jerk. No passing. But I need to get to Sasha 9's secret lab. Maybe you should have thought of that before. I did think of that before. That's why I'm here now. Exactly. Now you got to pay the toll. One arrowhead. Pay up. I found this thing. Is that what you're talking about? Yep. That's an arrowhead. How'd they get here? Frankie. The new kid can't be this dumb, right? The camp's built on an Indian burial ground, and... Oh my gosh! Indians buried their dead here? Ew! I hope not. No, stupid. They buried their arrowheads here. They're hidden underground, but they let out a little gas once in a while. Just like Coach Oleander. So if you see any of that stuff, just pull them right out. Like truffles. Anyway, let me have one of yours. Whoa there, you. Come here, you. Can't do the scavenger hunt without a list. Report back to me when you have enough items for your first promotion. Now get! So where do I... Hey, where'd he go? How does that old guy get around so fast? Hey, I got this button from Sasha 9 and I have to give it back. Do you know where his secret lab is? Do not know. Why not ask Foxy girlfriend over there? Again with the girlfriend thing. Listen. Hey, just kidding. Mikhail no woman good for only one thing. Wrestling. Unless have skinny arms like your girlfriend. Then, out of luck. Hey, Lily. Do you know where Sasha 9's secret lab is? Secret? It's printed on your map. Duh. Oh, I knew that. I was just curious if you knew where Sasha 9's lab was. Because I do. Uh-huh. Look at those two. Who'd even want a stupid friendship bracelet? I don't know. I wouldn't mind one. Yeah? Well, that's stupid. Want to measure my wrist? Just in case. Mm, no. Hey, if you were going to make a friendship bracelet, you could maybe use this button here. Why? So you could unbutton it and take it off when you got tired of being friends with me? Who said you were making it for me? Uh... You know, if you were going to shut up, you could use that button on your lip. How about that? Jeez. Hey, quit it! What you doing there? We're making friendship bracelets. You know, for our friends. Hey! Is that my name on that one? Not unless your name is Frankie or a kitty. Oh, I guess I saw an R and, and an A. What's your name again, kid? Spaz? My name's Raz. Well, Spaz, why don't you go bother someone else? Can I ask you guys a question? Mmm, hmm, no. Where'd you get your clothes? Because my sister, she's kind of fat and she has so much trouble finding good stuff. What? I said, do you know where Sasha's secret lab is? 
Why don't you go talk to someone who likes you and leave us alone? Hey, look, I got a button. Can I join your little craft club? Hey, look, I got an ugly face. Can I join your ugly club? Uh, Frankie, let me handle the insults, okay? Hey, look, I got a button. Can I join your little craft club? Hey, look, my dad's poor and I was raised in the circus. Can I join the Psychonauts? Hey! Dang, kitty, <laughs> you're the best. Hey, look! I got a button. Everybody says you guys suck. Just ignore him, Frankie. Ooh, ah. Just ignore him, Frankie. Hey! It's the king of the obstacle course! Hey, Rez! You're awesome! You must be a psychonaut by now! Yeah! Or even a double psychonaut! <laughs> oh, no. Not yet. But soon. Wow! Those two are so nice. Hey, what are you guys doing up here? Uh... Writing cheers! Oh yeah! Writing cheers! Wanna hear one? Uh... Okay. Ready? Okay! When I grow up... Hey, what you gonna be? I'm gonna be the best, just like my main homie. And when you say homie, whose horn might you be tootin'? The mind reading psycho thriller. Oh, you must mean Rasputin. Yeah! yeah! Woo! 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 How about another cheer? Okay, you start, Clem. You know Raz is the coolest. The master psychic duelist. Bad guys try to snuff him. So he beats him like a puffin. Yeah! Raz! Woo! Oh, God. That's so bad. I'm sorry. Puffin? What was I thinking? Hey, hey, Crystal. It's okay. No. I'm so stupid. So stupid. <laughs> I think that's all the cheers for now. Okay, Raz? Yeah, hey, sorry. I don't think I want any more cheers. Hey, I'll bet you can't write a cheer about this red button. Want a bet? You are on. Red button is the best. It fastens up my vest. If it breaks like the rest, the boys will see my chest. Yeah! Woo! Go Raz! Woo! <laughs> oh, look who's still punching! Yay, Yay Raz! Punch! 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 Excuse me. I told you the burgers ain't ready. Uh, no you didn't. The coals ain't hot. They're not gonna be done for a while. And maybe a week. A week? They're back ordered. I'm the only one back here. These things take time. I don't even want a hamburger. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? So, what do you want? Hey, where's my hamburger? I, I told you. Just kidding. I just want to buy stuff. Don't push me, Sonny. I can reach you with this spatula. Support your guy? I'll flip you like a half-done burger boy. Guy? I will take out your intestines, fry them into hash browns, and sew them back into your body before you ever get the chance to try that again. What can I buy with this button? We only take arrowheads here, kid. 100% pure titanium arrowheads. Squeezed from the ground like magical pimples popped out of Mother Earth's own back. Ew. Do over. Two, three. Hey, you guys are good. Thanks, man. Hey, do you have a lighter? Because if you lit it and held it up right now, that would be rad. And completely insensitive to me and my issues. Oh, right, right. Oh, never mind. I forgot about the whole fire bad thing for a moment. Hey, Phoebe, can I ask you a question? What? Have you ever had a weird nightmare about a bathtub? Is this a joke setup? Uh, never mind. Forget I said anything. Good, because if you tell one more drummer joke, I'll plant this stick in your eye. <laughs> Drum solo! Woo! <laughs> you heard the man. Yeah, baby! 
asks not for who the cowbell rocks. The cowbell rocks for thee. Oof! Why, I oughta... Simmer down there, Phoebe. You promised Mia you wouldn't burn any more kids. <sighs> okay. Wait. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop. Oh, man, is it me? Am I off again? No. Foot cramp. Ow. Hold on. Uh, okay, let's go. <laughs> you know what? You hated that part? <laughs> it's like you're reading my mind. Hey, you're not, are you? You're not supposed to. Relax. There's nothing in there I don't already know. Whoa. That was good. It's like we're the best band ever. I think it's actually quite likely. I feel bad for other bands. I know. We're hot. Let's do that again. <laughs> hey, how can you tell there's a drummer at the door? I don't know. How? The knocking speeds up. Oh, shut up. I did that on purpose. It's a jazz thing. Duh. Uh-huh. Hmm. No, that's still wrong. Okay. Let's do it like we did before lunch. Okay. Okay, that was the worst ever. God, why do we suck so bad? Hmm. Well, wait. Maybe we're really good, but we're playing in a genre of music that hasn't been invented yet. So it just sounds wrong. Whoa. We're so ahead of our time. Yeah. All right, then. Ah, I suck. No way. You're the best. That was good. I messed up. No, no, it sounded good. It sounded true, you know? Oh, don't patronize me, Hedge Mouse. You gotta get back on that horse, Phoebe. Get back on that horse and hit it and kick it and bash it and ring its bell. That's not how you treat horses. Well, which are you? A drummer or a horse lover? Forget it. Let's play again. Anything beats talking to you. Hey, Q? Uh, that last part? Yeah? Well, the thing is, see, my dog can scratch better than that. Okay, first of all, the last time I heard that joke, I fell off my grandma's solar-powered dinosaur and broke my metric buggy whip. Second of all, you know my dog died this winter, so it's not nice of you to make fun of it. I said my dog. Oh, so your dog's better than my dog? No, I... what? That's it. I quit the band. What? Come on, let's play band fight. Just for a bit? Oh, not that again. No. Hey, do you think Kitty likes me? Quentin, everybody likes you. Can we just play? No, I mean likes me, likes me. In the way that you like burning stuff. Hey, that's an unhealthy compulsion. I can't help myself with that. Yeah, that's what I mean. Do you think she has an unhealthy compulsion about me? No. Can we play? Okay, well, think about it. I'm going to ask you again later. Well, I think we nailed it. Want to lay off for the day? Sure! If you think it's ready to play in front of people, like, uh, Kitty, for example. Okay, one more time. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I have to ask now because this has been bugging me for a while. Shoot, bro. Kitty? <laughs> really, Quentin? Yeah. Kitty boo -bye. Yeah. I mean, she's cool and all, but I didn't think that was your type. Well, I mean, I guess I feel you on that one, but I can't explain it. It's like she has some sort of spell over me. Uh-oh. Hey, I like that. Dang, that was an accident. Oh. Hang on, let me see if I can do it again. <laughs> Wait, are you off key? Quentin, they're drums. Hmm, maybe it's me then. How do you tune these things? <sighs> Dude. Dude, that was so dope what you did just then. Don't stop, I'm on a roll. Drum solo. Yeah, you go, girl. Take it, Hedge Mouse! <laughs> Woohoo! Oh, you know what would be good? What? Like if we stopped right there? Like we just did? Yeah, but what if right when we stopped I went, ooh, ooh, like that? Ooh, ooh. You know, like, ooh, ooh. Quentin. All right, all right. Hey, you're the boss. Quentin, come on. You're the boss. I'm just saying that. Let's do it your way, boss lady. That's fine. <laughs> Hey, just pretend this is a lighter. It's red. Pretty inspiring. <laughs> you have a water phobia? <gasps> Me 
too! Huh? No. Well, yes. I just... I mean, my family has this problem with water. It's a bunch of hooey anyway. Some old gypsy curse about how we're all supposed to die in water. If you can believe that. Oh! I thought it was about the whole thing with the brain-eating fish that walks out of the lake at night to hunt for victims. Well, see ya! Um, hey Raz, I saw you and Lily talking in the coach's class, and I was wondering, were you asking her to go with you? What? No! I'm here to train. No distractions. Excellent! Bye! Hey, are you psychic fishing? I've read about that. Oh, I could never fish. That would be terrible. Regular people can be mean to fish, I guess, but I can't. I can hear everything the little guys are thinking. Fish think? About what? Well, normally not much, but today they're all kind of freaked. They're scared of something in the lake. Me too. Now that I know it's full of freaked out thinking fish, there's something big and scary out there, Raz. I wonder, could the old legends be true? What are you doing? Shh! I'm trying to hear them talk. Elton, ask if any of them have lost a big red button. Shh! I'm trying to hear them talk. Ugh. Shh! I'm trying to hear them talk. Hey, Mr. Cruller, can I take out a canoe? Mr. Who? You will call me Admiral, son. No, you can't charter a vessel. Not without an oarsman's badge. Excuse me, Admiral? Eh? Where can I get an oarsman's badge? I'd really like to take out a canoe. I gotta get it from one of the official camp counselors. I can't have just anybody in my fleet. <coughs> I'll make a canoe out of your hide if you try that one more time. <coughs> I will sink you so deep in that lake no dredge crew would ever find you. I will take one of these paddles to your psychic behind if you don't knock that off. Okay, here's my horseman's badge. I'm not that blind, you little rat. Now beat it until you get the real thing. What's that round thing up on the dock? That thing? Oh man, let me tell you about that thing. That thing is none of your stinking business. What are you guys doing? Beat it, you kid! You've got the best ideas, Bobby! Hey! Oh, no, you don't! <laughs> no. Hey! Mind if I scoot by? Not if you don't mind my fist scooting in your neck! Hey, check out this weird button. Yeah, no! Don't put me back in there, please! I'll be good! Hey, boss! Boss! What's wrong? Yeah, nothing! It's just... That button reminds me of a bad place. That's all. You heard the man. Get that button out of here. Hey, you're that new kid, ain't you? Well, I'm doing some advanced training right now, as a matter of fact. So I don't think new kid is really a name that you want to get too used to saying. Hold on there. You're not doing Sasha Nine's advanced training that he does in his secret underground lab, are you? Hidden deep within the iron walls of the GPC, where no one can hear you screaming? Why, yes, I am. Sakes alive! Well, nice knowing you. Hey, you guys sound great! <laughs> Much obliged, partner. That's really catchy. Thanks a lot, man. You guys are excellent. Mighty kind of you to say. Wow. Uh, glad you liked it. Seriously, you guys really sound good. Doggone it, Raz. We're trying to play here. Hey, I brought you a new guitar pick. Look. Ah, uh, quit fooling. That's just a button you took from the GPC across the crib. Probably radioactive. Dang, get that out of here. Be careful, eh? I just got this thing in tune. Ugh. 
Hey, you make me chip a tooth on this mouth harp, and there's gonna be a showdown. Was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. Hmm, <laughs> no. It must have been something else. You don't smell like pond scum. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. Watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Really? Who? You, tree sitter! <laughs> I saw Nils peeking into a hole in the girl's cabin. I'm hiding. And I thought, oh, Nils, when will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourself staring back. Uh-huh. What? I mean, he'd see my new boyfriend James staring back, and he'd be furious at Nils. Who's Nils? Exactly! And anyway, there wouldn't even be a hole because James fills my heart till sometimes I think it's gonna explode. One time, I made someone's head explode. Well, okay, maybe there's still a little hole. Actually, it happened four times. But James and I have each other now, and Nils is just going to have to deal with it. Now they make me wear this special hat, so I don't have any more accidents. Are you even listening to me, Dogen? I hope so. Nils? Nils! Oh, Nils. Nils! Nils? Um... Hey, Dogen, I got a secret for you. Nils. Hey, not fair. Whispering is so rude. What did he tell you, Dogen? Nils! Hey, Elka. Hey, butt out! Hey, Elka. Why don't you and your little goggles go poke around in someone else's private business? Nils? Uh, hey, Elka. Hey, Nosy, how about pulling your big beak out of our private business? Hey, look at this button I found on Nils' bunk. It looks like it came off a girl's dress. <gasps> I don't care. Looks like it was just torn off by force. I don't care. It's got little teeth marks on it. Get the out of my face before I shove it in your eye socket and sew it to your brain! Nels kisses girls on the mouth and likes it. Why don't you just take off your hat and kill me, Dogen? I don't know. Yo! Rasputin, not now! Just ignore him, Dogen. He's trying to nose his way into our private conversation. But... Nels! Nels! Oh! Oh! Quit it! You'll knock off my special hat! That looks like fun. It's work. I'm testing a low-orbit space plane design. How's the testing going? Not now, Raz. Hey, look, Chloe. I found a tiny red spaceship. Nice fake Trinaxian cruiser, Raz. But if you've done even the most basic research, you know that real Trinaxian cruisers have six viewports on top, not four. Well, I guess you just haven't seen this year's Trinaxian cruiser then. The Trinaxian galaxy exploded 400 years ago. Oh my god. This must be really valuable then. <clears throat> Earthling violence is why we haven't been asked to join the greater galactic community, you know. Excuse me, Mr. Ranger, but I'm looking for Sasha Nine's lab. Well, now, even if I knew where it was, and, and if it were down here, and even if you were very, very close to it right now, you, you shouldn't be poking around here. This forest is off limits. Now get! Hey, do you know where this button belongs? I know where it doesn't belong. It doesn't belong here in these off-limit woods. Just like you. Now get! Oh, wait. 
Now that's from the GPC. It does belong down here in these off-limit woods. Hmm. Now, but you don't. Forget! Ow! I will wither you into a neckerchief holder in two seconds, you hear me? Ow! I will burn you like a pile of autumn leaves if you do that again. I know places in these woods I could hide a body, so nobody would find it ever. Hmm, an eager one. Eager to learn, I wonder, or just eager to play? Sir, I am here to learn, sir. You're here to train hard? Mm. Yes, sir. Develop a skill? Yes, sir. To become part of a noble team? Uh, yes. Yes, to become... Yes. A janitor! No! What? I'm here to be a psychonaut. Ah, ah, there the brainy jub jub goes on upstairs. And down here it's pushing brooms, not bending spoons. <laughs> hey, Mr. Crawler, do you know where Sasha Nine's lab is? What? Huh? Secret underground lab? I don't have a secret underground lab. That's hot garbage. Now beat it. Get! Now stop staring at my mouse. So, you don't know where Sasha's lab is? I told you, I ain't got no secret lab. Oh, that German fella. Oh, he's dug in under the GPC over there. Where did you... Under the GPC. Maybe it's your ears I should be mopping. Oh. How about I clean your clock instead of the floor, eh? Ow! If I wasn't the one who'd have to clean it up, I'd mash you into a puddle of goo. Eh? Hey, I should ring you out like a wet mop. Ah, eager to get whacked in the head with a broom handle, too, I see. This mean anything to you? Ah, yes. So... So, so red buttons on your underwear. What does that mean? How, how will that help me find Sasha's lap? How the heck do I know? Just one of those things us old people like to say. <clears throat> hey! Welcome to the Whispering Rocket Underground Rapid Transit System. Would you like to go back to your private sanctuary now, Agent Kreller? Or somewhere else? Let's go to Ford's... I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, Noble Psycho Master. Hey, Sasha gave me this button and told me to come see him for special training. And what? Sewing? <laughs> When will you peek into the hole in my heart? <laughs> hey, who is that? Raz, is that you? It's me, Maloof! Hang on, buddy. Give me a sec to pop this tin can. Thanks. I thought I was gonna have to eat my own arm. What is this thing? It's a GPC, a geodesic psycho-isolation chamber. Oh, man, cool! Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, no. It's a six-sensory deprivation tank, a hermetically sealed metaphysical hotbox. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah. The staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Boolean dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. While in cooler, perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hey, wait! Hmm. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. Call me crazy, but I have a weird feeling that that button Sasha gave me goes here. <laughs> <laughs> 